Barkha Ritu has been a very uh, special festival which Banyan Tree has been doing and uh, since I am deeply involved with uh, Banyan Tree and uh, right from inception I've been part of Banyan Tree, Mahesh Babu and Nandani so I think to be back uh, for this amazing monsoon festival and perform in a hybrid manner and back uh, connecting with the audiences feels wonderful. Uh, Rain Chanted was uh, an interesting album uh, we did because uh, most of the albums I've done are thematic but I hadn't done something uh, completely based on the monsoons. So uh, Rain Chanted was a very much uh, new age sound, a world music sound, whatever you can call it. And uh, each track signif uh, signifies um, the essence of the rains, the beauty of the rains, romance of the rains, whatever you may feel. And personally, uh, rains are one of the best uh, uh, months in Mumbai for me because the weather actually cools down and the city looks lovely. So I think uh, the tracks, if you hear them, they're based on personal experiences. So Rain Chanted uh, is a special one. A track called Coffee and Rains. So uh, a simple moment captured where you're sipping uh, a cup of coffee while looking, uh, you know, on a beautiful uh, horizon, a uh, windswept uh, beach or something. So it was, uh, I think one of these tracks is probably my favorites. Uh, Santur is for everybody. I mean, uh, I would say um, just keep in mind one factor that uh, you need to tune this instrument. It's got a lot of strings, close to 100 strings. So there is a, a certain uh, knowledge that you should know about vocal before attempting the santur because if you are well versed with uh, a little bit of vocal uh, then you can tune the instrument because most importantly you should be able to tune it before playing it. So I think I would recommend it to all but for kids above 7, above 8 is the right time to start. Well pearls of wisdom are hard to find these days and I am also myself trying to um, find them but what I can say is that if you are dedicated, if you have the right guru uh, then I think uh, leave it up to him or her and uh, that's the one person you have to trust and who will be your chaperone, uh, who will train you, who will guide you and then it's up to your destiny, your luck and how far you can reach and all those things but it's a lot of dedication, perseverance and practice and endless hours of practice are required uh, each person varies in their practice levels, so uh, it's, it's something which uh, takes a lifetime, I would say, and still you keep learning. I started with Banyan Tree in 1996, it was my very first concert called Santur Virasat, which uh, I played along with my father, Panit Shiv Kumar Sharma and uh, Ustad Zakir Hussain. So this was the first uh, concert that we had called Santur Virasat. And uh, from 1996 to uh, 21, so it's been uh, 25 years of my association and I'm part of the Banyan Tree family and uh, I hope to continue and uh, it's a beautiful feeling to be part of Banyan Tree. Thank you.